Is that a shark? How's it going guys? So, out here a different spot today and um, trying to catch it before the winds get too bad. Um, it was, I think we started out, or I started out about seven, eight miles an hour. It's supposed to pick up to like 13 by the time I leave. Um, great, great day, beautiful, the nice, it's got a, got a nice flow on the water. So I wanted to go ahead and do a shout out. Um, I had, Man, my, my memory has been, it's not good anymore. But I wanted to give you a, give a shout out to Luis Gomez. Met him at HEB. Um, if y'all ever see me out and about, hey, don't hesitate to say hi and, you know, talk about some fishing and what's going on. Um, Tony Fernandez, uh, saw him at one of the launches. Um, a Marcus, actually, from um, Everyday Beach Life. Um, actually saw him after we went fishing at the at the Bill Miller's so yeah if you uh, you guys ever see me out hey don't hesitate to say hi um, I typically keep a decal in the truck and um, give, and, and uh, I'll get you a decal man um, so tie lines guys let's go fishing go oh oh no he's still on Skunk off, skunk off.
Dude, I'm trying to let you go. There you go. I thought I had saw something out there. I still think there's more too. Just kind of swam off. It's a dink. I mean, it's a little rat, I think. Could be wrong, I guess. Just make plot actually. I just barely make slot so if you don't know and you're afraid to ask what is slot well down here in Texas it is 20 to 28 inches and you are you pinch the tail to get the longest the longest uh, so this is 21 inches so you pinch the tail to get the longest point make sure that the nose is uh it touching the board and that's it so that is and it's a bag limit of three per day so that is a good redfish that is a good bingo so that sucker is going on the stringer we had um uh, we had uh what do you call it fish this past weekend and uh, so what I typically do is I uh, I love to eat fish all kind of all kind of fish and it's me my and my family my mom which is my family obviously so I keep enough fish for fish fry so that is on that was on the Cajun coastal uh, Cajun rods with a Saltese 2500 um, if you're interested this is a fantastic a fantastic uh, all-around setup um, the Cajun Coastal is perfect for kayak fishing. It has a uh, short tail on it, so it doesn't hit you in, in your PFD or when you're waiting. Fantastic setup. Very, very sensitive all around, one-handed. You could throw it one-handed. It is absolutely awesome. I have uh, used my, if you use my link, um, I don't get anything for it, but you do 15% off, including 15% uh, off, including um, free shipping. So uh, 
definitely guys give them a shout out give them a give them their fantastic rods um, so yeah Number two. so one of the things when you're out fishing open water is the potholes and um, basically what the potholes are the they are the clear areas you'll see underneath the water you'll see you'll see dark areas and you'll see lighter color areas well predator fish will hang around in these just on the just on the um, grass line and the and the uh, lighter color areas and ambush so idea is if, uh, if you're not seeing schools of redfish everywhere <laughs> you want to hit these potholes so typically that is a uh, is some sort of a plastic usually so you're not um, you know getting stuck in the grass all the time with a with a uh, wake bait or something uh, you could run a shallow wake bait depending on how uh, how shallow it is but the idea is to bring throw it past the past the pothole and just uh, bounce it into these open areas and a lot of times they're just sitting in there Well, time to put old shades on. If you guys are interested, these are Waterland sunglasses. Fantastic glasses. Probably the best bang for the buck that you can get. Uh, these, this particular model is called the Laydown, and uh, great fishing glasses. They're, uh, they have the the green mirror over the uh, amber lenses and the amber lenses if you don't know um, they help bring out the uh, they help bring out the contrast under the water great bunch of great bunch of uh, guys great company they're part of Sixth Sense in fact but uh uh, you can you can check them out. I put a link at the bottom. How's it going, and, guys? Uh, so I want to kind of give you an idea of where I'm fishing today. I'm fishing in uh, Corpus Christi Bay today. Oh man, <laughs> a little bird land right next, right on the boat. <laughs> that was awesome. So. a shark I mean, I thought there were sharks. <laughs> Two sharks. Oh, shoot. <laughs> <laughs> 